On today's episode, we're going to be looking at splash guards or guard liners. These are the rubber guard liners that go on the inside of your guard on the FJ Cruiser or a Toyota Hilux. I understand they're available for both. What I did is I actually tried to make some of these myself. And just from the local rubber place, as you can see there, it's just cracked and fallen apart. That's the front one, and you can see where it's actually snapped clean off there. Probably lasted about a year if I was lucky. So they aren't real good. Quite fortunate here in Melbourne, Australia, to have a manufacturer called Fab Wraps that makes a one piece in a guard liner. So if they interest you, hang around because what we'll do is a bit of a fitment video and keep your eyes out for a secret code word halfway through or maybe a bit more of a video so then you can get a 10% discount through Fab Wraps. As a part of the kit, you're going to get a set of instructions which are nice and detailed. It even talks about where to put different sized clips. comes with all the clips. These are really, really good quality. I uh, bought some other ones that I had and they are absolute rubbish compared to these. I wouldn't think they're particularly cheap. There's also a 6mm one, which is where the little star goes there. So, as I said, it's quite detailed. Nice set of instructions. To help you do the install, you need a trim tool, flat tip screwdriver, a bit of a mallet. Because believe me, to push those in by hand is quite difficult. And you're going to need something just to give it a bit of a light tap, just to get those home. Because pretty much once they're in, they're not coming out. I should also point out just how thick this stuff is. I understand it's three mil, so the standard stuff must be like one and a half, two mil at most. So, yeah, very good quality. What I understand, it's especially imported rubber. It's not just some rubbish that you get like I did from the local rubber place. And as I said, these clips seem really, really good. Very easy to remove the standard splash guard. Just pop these off. If you not too hard. Get yourself a trim tool. Yeah, just get those from your local auto supplier. Nice and easy. I'll pop those off. That one actually fell off. And then get your last one. They just pop off nice and easy. As you can see, these are literally falling apart now. I actually found the easiest way to fit this is if you get the clips and you pre-insert them into the rubber, then you put it up onto the car. I had to take mine off and on so many times just to put my cut in there for my remote resi line. I actually found it easier if I took the little pins out of the clips, those little things here. So whether that's the right way to do it, I'm not sure, but it seemed to work a little bit easier. So if you're having trouble getting these in, that way you can also just sit them in place without locking them. So I just started at the top, work my way around. That one at the top there is just a bolt that comes through, so it's just a hole so it doesn't rub obviously a hole in it when it's fitted up. So I'll get it on and I'll show you the final result. There's a little Christmas tree one that goes down in here and that's listed on the instructions, slightly different clip. Also found for that top hole where the bolt comes through or the back end of the bolt comes through, I just poked it around with a flat tip screwdriver got that to sink in nice then it's just a matter of giving all these a tap all the way around and she's fitted and there you have it the final result nice fit so obviously it's going to be a lot easier for you guys who haven't got a remote resi line like mine but uh, they are just made for a standard fj cruiser or a hilux so there you have it, probably a 15, 20 minute install. So if you want to support a local Australian business, I recommend Fab Wraps. It's a uh, nice little company, uh, Sandy the operator, very easy to talk to. I'm sure if you had some questions, you'd be more than happy to answer them. So if you have a look in the link on the description, I'll also put another link in the comments. So if you got some value out of the video, give us a thumbs up, or better still subscribe, and catch you on the next one.